According to Greg and John Murray, if you love what you do, you'll never have to work a day in your life. When you really like it and it, it's passion, it's not a job. I don't think of it as going to work every day. I think of it as achieving our dream. It's not a job, it's something we love. So when you come into work every day, when you wake up, boom, you can't wait to get here. And with food and hospitality like this, you too will be excited to get to Murray's. Located on Broadway in Revere, Massachusetts, Murray's Tavern may be new to the neighborhood, but it's a restaurant that's been decades in the making. Murray's Tavern is a lifelong dream come true. This is a dream of ours, which we began back in the blizzard of 78. I was a junior in college. I was only 12. And then we know the history that snowed for a day and a half. I looked for a partner to go out and shovel, and Greg was the first one. I'll do it. Right up, boom. First up in the morning, he's ready to go. It took us two days to do, but we did it together. And from then on, it's been a connection John and I have had since that first experience together. So it's been a dream of both of us to open up our own place someday. The brothers' goal? To build a place that reminded them of the restaurants they frequented back in the day. We grew up in those places. We had those neighborhood places that we went for everything. We wanted to bring that back. And what they've brought back is a comfortable spot with a menu that goes way beyond your average neighborhood tavern. We take great comfort classics and we elevate them. We give them our spin, our extra ingredient, the way we cook it, the way we prepare it, the way we source it. We keep it local. Starters at Murray's are all scratch made, from the aromatic Vietnamese style wings to these meatballs made with an old family recipe. Everyone has their favorite family recipe and so do we in the Murray family. It's the way we make them, the way we hand roll them, to the way we bake them, and then we cook them in the marinara. So they're tender, they're like butter, you gotta try it. They also knew they had to nail it when it came to the chicken parm, but they wanted to do it the Murray way. So a chicken parm egg roll, it's not only just the egg roll, but it's the marinara that comes with it, and then it's that little dollop of pesto on top of each egg roll. That just ties the whole experience of the marinara, the crunch of the egg roll. So it's all about taste and texture, and you get it all in the egg roll. Handhelds at Murray's range from grilled flatbreads topped with grilled chicken, avocado, applewood smoked bacon and ranch dressing, to a perfectly executed fried chicken sandwich. But it's the double smash burger that's really a flavor bomb for your belly. When you create that double stack with the homemade pickles, the Alabama white sauce, the truffle ketchup, you put it all together, toasted buns, and then you melt that cuckoo cheese flowing down there like a volcano with the lava. You gotta lean over your plate because the juices start coming out. You can't have a tavern and not have a great smash burger. If you want a big bowl of pasta, Murray's has you covered with slow simmered bolognese and big bowls of mac and cheese, all using the Murray's favorite pasta, radiatore. The radiatore is a magnet for just sucking up the sauce. It looks like a radiator. It has all the slots. So guess what? All the sauce is going into the slots. You have two or three bites of that and it's like a meal in itself. It's the way the cheeses blend. The crucolo, a nice aged gouda in the fontina, it's delectable. The entrees at Murray's run the gamut, from tender Spanish octopus topped with mango salsa to pan-seared salmon over roasted butternut squash risotto to good old fish and chips. But the eight ounce pan roasted filet mignon is the real showstopper of the place. It's a beautiful tender piece of meat. We're serving it with asparagus and homemade garlic mashed potatoes. We serve it with a bordelais sauce, but we garnish it with a little chimichurri on top to complement that dish. At dessert, the screwball waffle is an absolute must, topped with peanut butter cup gelato and a screwball peanut butter whiskey caramel. This dessert is so good, you probably should order two. They get the warm waffle, the ice cream it's melting, the screwball glaze. People fight for it. So now people that know it, they don't order one, they order two. And what began in a blizzard has become a warm, cozy place you'd want in your own neighborhood. You can talk about it. You can say, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. We finally did it and I love it. I'm living it and I couldn't be happier. Since the blizzard of 78 to here, it's a dream come true. Thanks to the blizzard of 78, Murray's Tavern in Revere. Mm -hmm.